Hi guys, my name is Alexo Avrenin. Welcome to YouTube channel Senior QA Automation Engineer. Before we start, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I want to show you how to use Java conditions with elements in your Selenium test. I have already initialized Chrome driver in my test. I explained this part in my previous Selenium videos. I want to get a specific URL from browsers and type driver get and past URL. After that, I want to take locator for a title of my list web elements in UI. I do right click and select inspect elements, tab elements shown in dev tools. I can see selected block of HTML code for this web element. I press Ctrl F and it's open search field for me. I can type and build my locator. Xpass start always from double slash. My element is link starts from A. After I open brackets and type add href equals single quote, value of href, close single quote and brackets. Because we have couple web elements with same locators, I should add something unique in this XPath. I add text from this element. Now this locator is unique on this web page and we can use it and don't care about duplication. We create web element variable and add driver find element this locator inside. I create condition if I put inside name of web element get text contains specific string. After we need to add some actions in curly brackets for our condition, first of all I want to interact with our search field. This element has ID. It means we can easily create a CSS selector. Just type hashtag and value of ID. Ok, I find this element, we type something in search field, we always use send keys for that. For example, we can find selenium. Then I try to find locator for button. It has class button and input tag. I tried dot button with CSS selector because in CSS selector it it means class button. But it's not unique element on page. It can be broken easy because developers can new button anytime. Same if I use tag input dot button. In this case, yeah, it's not unique. In this case, I try to create XPath with more parameters for this web element. Because class is not unique and this button has only class, type and value, 
Xpass always starts from double slash. Type input tag and I add two values in my Xpass. It should be more stable. For that I use expressions for class and for value. Now XPass is correct and unique. I can use it. I just find and click this button. Okay, I run my test. It has failed because Selenium can find my title link. It's happened because I initialize web element variable before I open my browser. And it doesn't work so. You can find element only if web element is already exist on this specific web page. We need to move it after Selenium open our URL in code. But I think it's not very comfortable approach for me to initialize something inside my test. In this case, I better create by variables for locators and replace them in test. Ok, browser open a Maven repository, can find my title, type selenium word and click search button and open search results for us. I need add a search for adding expected result in test. Now I'm checking functionality of text fields and button, but I need to verify a specific expected result. For example, I should verify that after I type word in search field, I click button, search result is displayed, search result. For that I need locators of title search results. I press F12 and open elements and dev tools. And I can see that block of HTML for elements starts from A. I create XPast, first of all type double slash and A tag. Now you can see how many elements with same tag a href. A href is always mostly link. Href should be in brackets and with add sign. I need to add value in href in sign in single quotes. The problem is if I use full link in href, it detects only one search result. In this case I can use part of this link and find many search results with selenium word inside these links. It can be better verification for my test. I can create a sort true and add this locator. I put assertion that I want to see this elements link should be displayed for me. I saw true except only boolean's values. It works for me.
Okay, I run my test with assertion. Okay, my test can verify that we can find Selenium word in our search results. And my conclusion about this test. First of all, first step, we create by variables and driver. Second, open URL. Third, if Selenium can find specific title, type Selenium in search field and click search button. And step number four, verify that Selenium is shown on search results.